Name of this vlog is What an Idiot, Dude. The whole vlog, we're just gonna say, What an Idiot, Dude. What an Idiot. 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 <laughs> my own thoughts? What an Idiot. What an Idiot. What an Idiot. <laughs> go, go, go. What an Idiot. We've been getting a lot of questions about pinching acrylic and or gel. Does that need to happen consistently in the salon? Trace, come and have a seat. Tracy was on her way to go do something, probably nothing, because Tracy doesn't do a whole lot here. Get it? I get it. Get it? I mean, get I get it. it. <laughs> what does she do, bro? Nothing. Exactly. <laughs> Pinching acrylic, this has been coming up. Do I need to do this consistently with acrylic or gel function? Obviously, I've seen you guys pinch, but if you're in the salon and you're cranking, do you have to, like, you do an acrylic and you have to take the time and stop and pinch every single one? With gel, how do you do it? Can you do it? Can be done. If I'm throwing a set on her, I'm not thinking about, you know, how much C-curve I have to put in. I yeah. usually pinch the form enough where it puts a natural C-curve in. Oh. So if there is a little bit of width and I want to try to reduce that, then yes, I, I definitely focus on that. Because, I mean, when you do pinch it, it makes it look more narrow. Right. You know, which basically will help you. And strength too, right? I mean, in theory, yes, you can get more strength. Definitely. Um, you can create a thinner structure. Trace, in the salon, when you were cranking sets, and you were money, doing 15, 20 sets a day, sons and daughters. Uh, is he okay? Not in any way, no. Did you, <laughs> how did you do that? Were you pinching every single one? I pinched it, I pinched it. What were you doing? Talk to me, girl. <laughs> I'm in a mood right now. Um, so, you just so. Can't even hold a straight face. <laughs> what an idiot! What an, what an idiot. idiot! What an idiot! What an idiot! What an idiot! So, what would you do? I pinched acrylic. You did every single nail. I tried to remember. Yes. So basically, when you first start and you're doing forms and you know you want to pinch acrylic, uh, you might forget one or two. One yeah. To skip a few. Right. Uh, oh, that rhymed. But once you get a process down, you just go on automatic pilot. So I'd get one, two, three nails crossed, come back with my magic wand pinch. So nails that I knew I needed C-curve, I would usually always put in acrylic. Okay. So I could pinch. Um, and I did make it a habit to pinch my acrylics. It just, you get a, just a nice looking nail that way. Yeah. Gel, um, if a person needed that pinch, I probably wouldn't put them in gel because gel is going to take more time to pinch and I don't have the time for that. So I would actually pinch the form more so, yeah, to so create kind of like, the curve. Right. So that's kind of what, I mean, that, that makes sense in terms of speed, even with acrylic though, couldn't you, couldn't you do that? Like that makes sense to me. Yeah, like we were saying, you do that little, I mean, it takes me two seconds to come oh, back get with a little them, extra. And it just, yeah, Trace, Trace I, is right. I mean, if you I'm do remember, <laughs> <laughs> typically we'll go in to pinch the body just to make sure that it tightens up slightly. Yeah. It makes it easier to file. You can get a really, really tight shape, especially with your sidewalls. Um, if it's, you know, if it's pinched. When I do your nails, I think majority of the time I do, if I can remember, I go in and I try to pinch as much as I possibly yeah. can. Even in the real times, I pinch. Yeah. Yeah. So go through and pinch. It doesn't take any time and it just makes that nail look a little sexier. better. Can you say that about nails? You can oh. say that about you can say that about nails, Trace. Sexy and nails go together like Habib. Oh sexy God. Habib. Nails sexy. Yeah. What an idiot. 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 Ah! Young Nails is committed to giving you the best nail education in the world. Check out more of our videos. Head right over here. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel and do that by clicking right over here.